she's the, the only nerd girl I ever met that he can respect, right? But the likes him for who he is, but yeah, of course, now she's like, yeah! <laughs> she's the perfect nerd! She's the ultimate perfect nerd girlfriend, oh my god! But that's just pretty sweet because, you know, he has no friends and she's like, I'm also an otaku nerd. Ah, senpai! I'm a hot, yeah, like basically the ultimate gamer girlfriend. I like, oh, you have the latest game? All this, all this, oh yeah, you have a... They have the DUC? Oh, we're gonna play it, Senpai! You know, see? She's attractive as well, but she's also used a like, crazy nerd girl. Yeah, she's like, oh my god! Are you have the latest Ender Ring DUC? I haven't played it yet! You know, she's basically that. Oh my god, she? I finally have a girlfriend or something? <laughs> but see, I mean! Is that like, pretty sweet? She's, she's just like, oh my god, I'm playing fighting games with a cute girl. And she's like, and she's better than him better. Of course, she's like, she knows all the combos! Oh my god! This girl's amazing! She's the ultimate gamer girlfriend! He's like, whoa! <laughs> she knows every combo with Dial! Oh my god, I'm gonna marry her! <laughs> it's uh, it's high school girl all over again. So seriously, everyone, this might be the best new episode. Like, honestly, this was a really good episode. Obviously, it had to be a little nerd with Taco right? but very similar course to Marin Shan, right? You know, this is Tupit of Marin Shan, hot girl that loves like arrow games, you know, hand games, right? She wants to be a cosplayer on the fan page. But, yeah, and speaking, Really nice episode one, really sweet episode one. Like basically, the main cast is a typical nerd, he has no friends, he's bullied, right? No one likes him. Everyone just sees him, right? You know, you know what I mean? Typical that kind of storyline, right? And he meets this nerd girl, right? She's even more nerd than him. She can play Street Fighter, <laughs> yeah, she's like a gamer, and she's a hardcore gamer, right? And she also has no friends or whatever, right? And they kind of both meet in this, like, oh yeah, we both like these weird nerd people that like, you know, cosplay and like this like you know cliche like, like cringe nerd stuff right weird games and so on they're very etchy and she's like yeah it's my dream <laughs> so, so, so they kind of both fall in love she's like oh dooky dooky in the, la in the last moment she's gonna be all like oh my god he's my perfect boyfriend right so on so it's like the two biggest nerd people meet each other and of course they have no social skills because it, neither of them have any friends or whatever i've never had any friends or whatever. so honestly Pretty sweet anime, but obviously, if you like Marin Shan, you know, Marin here, right? Yeah, Marin Shan over here. Very, very similar, right? You know, etchy cosplay stuff. He's helping her, you know, making her cosplay stuff, right? And obviously, they fall in love. But I have to say, you talk about the review part, but it is not the same thing exactly because this guy and God, you are very different characters. But anyway, guys, hope you guys subscribe, slap button, check out the full reaction, guys, and of course, review in the end of it. Here we go, guys. Marin Shan at home! I've been waiting, man. This is not a guy, Roo. It looks exactly like it's Marin Shan. It's the same, same story now. It's a guy, meets some hot, like, cosplayer guy who's chick, and she dresses up or something. Yeah, and she just had this cat, I guess. You hate this otaku guy. This is like, he's our. He's just like me, he likes anime characters, yeah, and he's gonna meet this girl that likes <laughs> cosplaying, right? That's to, to cosplay as this badass anime. Yeah, she's obviously gonna cosplay as his favorite character. Oh, I love this character, right? He's like, yeah, I love this hot angel chick. He's like, 2D girls are the best. Yeah, very relatable character. Super relatable. He's like, I hate humans. <laughs> I just wanna, I just wanna maybe 2D girls. Everyone hates him. He's like, oh, disgusting nerd. Yeah. He's like, that's right. That's why I only date 2D girls. 2D girls rules! And, but of course, this girl is gonna dress up. Of course, this girl is gonna be Marish at home and dress up like her, yeah. yeah. But it's, uh, it's very similar in that sense to obviously. Oh my god! Cosplayer nerd girl! She's super hot, of course, but eating glasses. It's like not really. No, <laughs> it's like, you know, she removes the glasses. She's actually super attractive, yeah. <laughs> like, yes, she's removed the glasses. She's nerd girl, man. She's got a nerd girl look, but she removes the ponytail and the glasses. Then she's be super. Then she actually super hot, yeah. Otaku nerd girl, which actually is very attractive. Yeah, Kawaii! Yeah, but she's, she seems to like cosplay, so it's gonna be his dream girl, man. Otaku girl. No. She ruined his uh, <laughs> custom made figures, of course. Because the guy got special figures, so you can, um, yeah, well, you can remove them. Um, she probably likes it. She's like, oh, it's terribly done. She's like, no. Nah. The guy that made this is a noob! If back in my days, when you made figures, he's just like insulting his otaku level. She's like, you're terrible, like, this clothing here doesn't fit, yeah, like, clearly badly done, like, the way you did this art here, yeah, oh, an effing noob. 
Yeah, she's like, you you suck at this. <laughs> Otaku girl! Okay, I gotta like her. She's super likeable. Yeah, she's like, you have weak nerd power. I would have made way better sexy panties. Okay, she's like, I like pantses. Okay. I'm a panty designer. It's like, well, what? <laughs> oh my god, okay, she's a complete hentai. Oh, yeah. Erro, yeah, she likes it. This woman is very openly a weird otaku girl. Yeah, she's a perv. It's not hen! <laughs> think I'm a hentai? He's like, no! There is. <laughs> now they're both like, you think I'm a hentai? He's like, no, 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 I'm also. <laughs> he's, like, he's defending her by being like, oh yeah, don't you worry, girl, I'm also a weirdo. Yeah, we both t together, perverts. Yeah, he's very into it. Yeah, he's like, he's best his match here. Otaku perv guy, Miss Otaku girl. And she's also a complete pervert. Yeah, she's like, yeah, let's make some hentai together. It's like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. She, she's like Mari. She wants to do like you know weird arrow game cross. <laughs> yeah, they both got him otaku. This is like two hentais meet each other. This anime is crazy, man. It's like two massive otaku hen people are befriending each other. These are ob they obviously gonna smash. <laughs> yeah, they're both weirdos. Yeah, it's like two disgusting perverts uh, meet each other. Yeah, it's like uh, he never met that girl as nerdy as him, right? It's actually kind of romantic in that way. Yeah, she's the only one nerdier than him. Yeah, he's like, no, she's gonna hate me, but she's actually like uh, super like. Oh, oh finally, that guy that understands what I like. Senpai, Senpai you're the hottest guy ever. <laughs> yeah, it's actually pretty sweet because he's just like. Every girl hates me because I'm a complete you know, otaku and she's like, oh, oh senpai, you turn me on senpai, it's so hot, I also love otaku stuff. Yeah, she's into it, she's like, oh yeah, senpai. She's just like mine, she's like, oh, he's my favorite hentai, he's like, what's wrong with her? What's wrong with this girl? She's like, oh yeah, I, uh, I love Aero games, I want to be a cosplayer of Aero games. He's like, what? what's wrong with you, girl? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> yeah, she's a complete pervert, bro. She's a version of Shan. She's like, my dream is to be a perv. It's like, a game game. Just like Marin Shan, yeah. I always liked sexy arrow game characters. Like this. <laughs> she's like, I have no friends because everyone thinks I'm a complete weirdo. He's like, yeah, yeah, I wonder why, girl. You're totally normal. Yeah, it's like. Yeah, she's super turned on by like sexy cosplayer girls. Yeah, she's like. Hot elf chicks! Yeah, so she's like a complete otaku nerd lady that wants to dress up as sexy okay. Yeah, her dream is to be a sexy cosplayer, yeah. yeah. Oh no, here comes some elf mifu! Oh my god, here comes some elves! And they're like, you could be one of us one day! Her dream is to be- I will also be an elf wifey one day! <laughs> her dream is like, I also wanna be an elf cosplayer! Senpai, please help me in my cosplay career, yeah. Me? So I need a perv. I need an ally to become famous. Yeah, she wants her. To, she wants him to be her. She wants to make a cosplay YouTube channel, right? She wants her, him to do, take photos of her, right? So she can sell her like hot photos. Yeah. She basically is like, I wanna be an only fan. <laughs> yeah, she's like, I wanna make arrow stuff. She's literally like, I wanna make an only fan page, and I want you to be my like cameraman. Wanna join me in my dream? It's like, yeah, that's like a super normal dream. Please, senpai! I wanna make my own only pan page! Yeah, I need a camera, man. <laughs> it's super weird, Jesus Christ. What a dream she has. Ultimate anime dream. I wanna be a hot anime. Now it's very Marishan. Now she's just like, oh yeah, let me show you my outfit. It's like, no! It's like, well, I mean, yes, but not right now, you weirdo! Yeah, she's very like Marishan. She's like, let me show you my titties. Yeah, it's like, what? <laughs> oh yeah, she made her own outfit here. Yeah, she's gonna show me her cosplay outfits. Hardcore girl. Here we go. She's gonna show her outfit. Come on, senpai! I was gonna fall in love with her now. She, he really likes her because she's the, the only nerd girl ever met that he can respect, right? But they likes him for who he is, but... Yeah, of course, now she's like, yeah! <laughs> she's the perfect nerd! She's the ultimate perfect nerd girlfriend! Oh my god! This is just pretty sweet because, you know, he has no friends and... She's like, I'm also an otaku nerd. Ah, senpai! I'm a hot! Yeah, like he's... Yeah, so now he yeah, I guess nose bleed, right? But I mean he never met a girl that he liked, right? Everyone's bullying him. It's actually pretty sweet. Senpai! I mean it's actually pretty sweet because yeah, everyone else is mean to him, right? She's the only girl who's ever nice to him. 
But of course, she's like a hardcore nerd <laughs> too. <laughs> she's just like, ah, oh, senpai! Yeah, because, you know. How does it look, senpai? Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. But it's, he's like a tragic nerd guy. They're more than. Gordio isn't as bullied, though. Gordio is like a. Yeah, this guy is, has set up no friends, right? Here we go. What about Patsu? Yeah, she's gonna show her uh, stuff to him, of course. Yeah, how do you like my uh, how my ass looks? <laughs> of course, gonna be. Yeah, he looks fine. Yeah, sure on that. Yeah, here we go. You wanna look for real, real senpai? Are you sure? So you can take a look at my ass. Yeah, uh, you have to verify my pants. <laughs> like, but honestly, it is pretty, pretty cute as anime. I mean, it's obviously very similar to Mario Shot, but it is pretty cute because yeah, he got bullied. He got oh, he has finally meets a girl that also is a nerd like him, right? The ultimate gamer, gamer girlfriend. And then she's like, oh yeah, I'm into like hand games, so I want to do arrow gear stuff. <laughs> and then he wakes up in her lap here, I guess, because, yeah. Oh, senpai, you okay? Daishobu, <laughs> senpai! <laughs> He's so in love with her. But he just, you know, before he met her, he hated every woman, yeah. He was like insane before he met her. He was like, every woman is evil. Every woman is a douchebag. Yeah. And now he's like, I like women. <laughs> Senpai. And now he's like, oh my god, women are the best. Yeah. And now he's like super in love here. So, somewhat adorable. Like two nerds. I'm gonna play games together too. But this is what I mean. She's basically the ultimate gamer girlfriend. She's like, oh, you have the latest game? Oh, this audio. Oh, yeah, you have a. They had a DUC? Oh, we're gonna play it, Senpai! You know, see? She's attractive as well, but she's also used a like, crazy nerd girl. Yeah, she's like, oh my god! Are you heard the latest Ender Ring DUC? I haven't played it yet! You know, she's basically that. Oh my god! It's so awesome! Yeah, she's basically like super nerdy. Oh my god, they got this thing? So overall, she's like, the perfect girlfriend for a gamer, right? Yeah. Because she's, she wants to, you know, play all the games with him. She wants to dress up with all his favorite characters. Let me see this. She's like the ultimate perfect girlfriend, yeah. Oh, you're into Tifa? This is a Tifa cosplay, you know, basically, right? Yeah, and now they're playing like fighting games together. Tano yeah. Si, he's Tano like, oh my god, Tano Shi! I finally have a girlfriend or something! <laughs> he's like, but see, I mean! He's like, that's pretty sweet. She's the ultimate girlfriend. He's just so hempy. He's so happy now, Senpai. He's just like, oh my god, I'm playing fighting games with a cute girl. And she's like, she's better than him better. Of course, she's like, she knows all the combos! Oh my god! This girl's amazing! She's the ultimate gamer girlfriend! He's like, whoa! <laughs> she knows every combo with Dial! Oh my god, I'm gonna marry her! <laughs> it's, uh, it's high school girl all over again. She's now hard, yeah, she's the ultimate fighting girlfriend. She's like, I know all the combos, so but let's do it! Oh my god, it's so adorable. She's both absurd and attractive, but also... She's a, a professional video gamer. <laughs> and she got a new outfit here. Yeah, yeah, and she has new outfits all the time. Oh, is that a new outfit? Oh, yeah, different. Yeah, okay, same character, but yeah. This one is like a biker girl thing. Something like that. Yeah, it's different out yeah, sign of it. The other one's off eyes or under boob. This is one is clear in the middle. Yeah, heart cleavage right there, so. <laughs> Let me show you my next outfit. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Now it's going to be OnlyFans page. Now it's going to be, let's do OnlyFans! Yeah! <laughs> let's be an OnlyFans. <laughs> now you're asking your new boyfriend to take photos of her online so you can make something on. Okay, and she also, she's in love with Senpai now. Yeah, and of course now she's like, Doki Doki! Now she's like, oh my god, he's the first guy that ever liked me. <laughs> she's like super hot, but you know, she's a like weirdo, so she has no friends, right? Oh my god, so she, now she's like, oh, Doki Doki Senpai! Now she is like falling for him, right? But obviously that's kind of silly. I mean, it makes sense in the way that she's like, yes, yeah, she's like absurdly attractive, but as we know, right? She's an otaku, she's a gamer nerd, but she has no friends. Every, all the girl dislikes her, right? Because she's a nerd or so on. And the guy thinks she's weird, right? So even though she's like 10 out of 10 babe, right? Yeah, she has no friends or whatever, right? So she's like, oh, doki doki, he likes me back. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. I guess all the cats, I guess, are going to be in the ending here. Yeah, she's doing like the heart thing there. Oh, yeah, different characters. They probably have all the girl later to make it more like a dragon drama, as so always with animes. They probably have a horror later. So nerd, all the nerd girls will join probably. Unless she's both of them in the dance here. I don't know, she, she might be both of them. <laughs> she might be both, I don't really know. The, the perfect nerd girl might be both. 
<laughs> because uh, probably Sensei, but I think it's like two different characters. I think it's like two nerd girls. I love the Sensei. <laughs> Clearly, the teacher is like, I like it. <laughs> They're gonna have one female teacher that's like all in the cosplay. She's like, yeah! <laughs> oh my gosh, it's awesome. Yeah, the <laughs> Sensei. Yeah, here we go, man. This is a great ending. He's like, yes. But obviously, Sensei, they're going to have a teacher, right, that, that helps them do cosplay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They have to have one advisor teacher that's like, okay with it. That they're doing weird cosplay stuff at school, right? And that's going to be her, the, probably like the uh, medical, like, doctor or scientist sense. Because she's like a robot, her, right? a medical robot. Her. Yeah. She's all like, whoa, I love idol girls. <laughs> Something like she's all okay with it. She's like, yes, only fans page, do it. So that's it, ultimate nerd girlfriend. But seriously, she is like 10 out of 10 nerd girlfriend. Otaku, yeah, otaku extreme girlfriend. 2D love. Uh, but I, I liked it, yeah, it was really good. I will say that he's more cliche though than Godio. In one way, I like how Godio couldn't write in, of course, Marin's boyfriend though. He's quite different, right? He's not actually like the typical like, protagonist in his animes. He's kind of like, he, he's a nerd that can do tailoring, right? But he doesn't really like the nerd stuff or gaming stuff. He is a loner more by, by his personality, not because he has no friends. He has social skills and so on. He doesn't really, you know, he's not a party guy kind of thing. So he's kind of, he's kind of different, right? He's not the tip, honestly, he's not the only he's not a typical, like, you know, basic protagonist. This guy here, though, he feels very much more that classic, you know, gamer otaku character. He's in a lot of elements, right? He loves video games. He's got a lot of figures with, you know, sexy waifus, right? And he's all like, oh, everyone bullies me because, you know, I like the waifus, I like the hot poster, right? Then this girl comes in and she also likes the, you know, she's like, oh my god, you got this po you got this figure? I got the one and she's naked. <laughs> yeah, she's like, I got the extra pervy figure. He's like, what? And he's like, yeah, it's super rare. <laughs> right? He's like, yeah, it's rare. How do you buy that one? Oh my god, yeah. And they're both like super freaking out, right? So these two are much more similar to each other. These two characters are much more similar. I don't think Godio and Mari are that similar to each other at all, no. And they kind of just fall in love right over a course. Hanging out all the time, and Godi was very, you know, supportive and nice and so on, right? And, uh, you know, Mari has a lot of depth to her as well, right? Not just being a hot gal, right? But uh, this here feels more like a typical, just like two weirdos falling in love, right? So more in that, like, gamer, you know, like, uh, love is of Utako, or like, gamer, used to end was called gamers, right? Where the bunch of video game players, all hardcore video players, and they have no, again, Nintendo on, so they have no skills, right? So they come to social stuff and so on. They can have to get good there, right? But all, all was, I found it really sweet, right? Because, yeah, the guy is like, oh, he's like kind of an incel a little bit. Like, he's like, I hate girls. Everyone is mean to me. You know, all the women are mean to me. I don't want to have a girlfriend, right? Then he comes to his, his first, like, nerd girl he ever met, right? And she's all like, oh, my God, Senpai, you're playing Street Fighter? Can I play? I love to play Kami, you know? And she kicks her ass, and he's, like, better than him. He's like, oh, my God, a girl better than me in Street Fighter? Kind of like, you know, high school girl, right? Basically, he's like, oh my god, I have to marry her. <laughs> I have to marry her. <laughs> it's like, my god, ultimate girlfriend, right? So he's like, oh my god, every guy's dream is to have a girlfriend better than me in Street Fighter. Yeah, it's every man's dream, every nerd's dream is like, I wish my girlfriend could beat me in Street Fighter. This is every, every guy he dreams of. There's a dream for every guy, right? And she cannot do that, right? So, yeah, it was very sweet, honestly. And of course, Edge as well. She's showing her tatas, right? She's doing that. So, Ali is a good anime. You can have that. Because, I mean, it's a mixture, right, of etchy, just like Marin Shan, right? Oh, look at my new outfit, you know, it's very etchy, right? But also, just like Marin Shan, it's very wholesome, too, right, you know? These are two people, again, they have no friends, and now they're suddenly meeting someone that's kind of like themselves, right? They're finally meeting someone they can be in love with, someone that actually has similar personality with them, and they can kind of, you know, not be judged or bullied, right? Because, of course, both of them have terrible lives otherwise. So, it's, it's sweet, but also etchy. So, it's like that... It's your whole sub, just like Marin. So very similar to Marin and that's yeah, we almost the exact same genre, right? Not only in the same genre as in her behavior and so on, but I mean it's like it is a very similar thing is how it kinda of fills those two, uh, I would say, uh, from an entertainment standpoint, right? Both that it's like etchy as hell, right? She gets very really outfits, showing her up by showing ass and one, right? But also there's this sweet moment of her like making him like girls more, him making a back and forth, right? So it's also both romantic and also very wholesome. And then, of course, etchy. So <laughs> very, very, very much like a marriage and anime. But I really like it, guys. Check it out. I freaking loved it. It was really good. But of course, I do love Mario and Shandor. So for me, this is like a, obviously a go to anime. Uh, Bam, subscribe, like button. And soon we have Nier. Of course, come back. Nier Automata. Come back soon, yeah.